in the outskirts of urban Malibu, nobody will ever even notice, especially back in 1961, a place called Arroyo Sacred, which surfers nicknamed Sacus, which later became known as Leo Carrillo State Park. And this is a young surfer who had recently just won one of the first surfing contests ever held in Southern California at Huntington Beach. This is Ron Sizemore riding Arroyo Secus. In the year following his victory at the Huntington Beach Surfing Championships. What's interesting about Ron Sizemore is not that he was a contest winning surfer, it's just that in the very early 60s he was the only contest winning surfer around. At this time in the early 60s, the contest circuit in California had not really started. Most top surfers considered their activities to be outside the confines of normal society, and a contest about their sport just seemed to be a little bit too much like the society they were avoiding. All that was about to change. In the meantime, one of the perks of being a contest winning surfer in the very early 60s is it pretty much ensured that your surfing ability was going to be a notch or two above that of the average surfer, and also ensured that you were probably going to get the best waves of the day all to yourself, or mostly to yourself. Ron Sizemore on a June gloomy day at Arroyo Secus.